Hi guys and welcome to an Evolve Stage 2 video. So we are currently on Sheer Horror Week 2 and you know that means we have some more new content. If you watched last week's video I mentioned that this week we'd be getting some more crates and they are essentially rewards for playing, well winning should I say, um, the special game modes like Cataclysm. Um, so these new crates that we have unlocked um, you can actually purchase those within the game with the game keys you get for playing matches. Now if you go on the website the only info you get is the name obviously and what the boxes contain. So we've got the basic crate, the premium crate, the deepest dark crate, the cataclysm crate and the overpowered crate. So let's head into the game and see what's actually been added. Right, as you can see, a new menu option has been created called Crates, funnily enough. So if we head on down and click it, uh, you'll be taken to the Crate Store. Now unfortunately you can only purchase the basic crates for now, at the price you can see on the screen now. So let's open one. So this time we got some badges, woo, which is less than exciting, but you get the idea anyway. I have also checked the store and you can't currently buy the crates from there yet, but I'm sure they'll be added in because they're also adding these new gold keys, which I'm sure you can buy with real money. But not only the crates this week, we have also been given some new perks. Both the monster and the hunters have been given two new perks each so let's um have a look at them let's start with the hunters shall we the first perk we have for the hunters then is improved healing so this increases the incoming healing by a certain percentage so we've got level one six percent level two seven percent and level three eight percent so that is the first perk and the second one we have for the hunters is increased agility so uh, level one plus seven percent jetpack dodge efficiency seven percent reduced jetpack recharge rate so this is obviously agility and obviously as you can see it goes up to ten percent and then finally twelve percent now both of these perks start in the major category so there's none been added to the the minor category um, so these these two are in the major and also in the superior we have obviously the other um, ones of these. So maximum agility, you've got 15%, 17%, 20%. And where is it? And vigorous healing is 10%, 11%, and 12%. So let's head back. Uh, we are going to look at the monster perk. So the new ones, again, they've added nothing to the minor. Let's go to the major. So we've got two... We've got two new. We've got Heavy Hitter and Aggravated Wounds. So these are quite interesting, actually, when you have a read of them. So, Aggravated Wounds. Melee attacks reduce healing received by 7% by for 1.5 seconds. So the, this is a complete opposite of the Hunter perk, which they get increased healing. This one takes that healing away. So, Aggravated Wounds. And the other one is Heavy Hitter. So level 1 is 8% longer cooldowns and 5% increased damage. So you get a minus which you get longer cooldowns but you get increased damage. So that goes to 8 and 5, then to 9 and 6 and to 11 and 7. Now obviously these have nice, uh, nice, these are nicely named. I prefer how the monsters perks have been named. So if you go to the superior, so brute force is obviously the bigger one to uh, heavy hit. So we've got brute force, 13% longer cooldowns. 8% increased damage so that goes up to 14 and 9 and level 3 is 16 and 10 and obviously the other one we have is infectious wounds and this does the same obviously and um, so melee attacks reduce healing by 10% then 12% and finally 14% so they are the new perks we have been given this week for both the monster and the hunters and that is pretty much it. There have been some new skins and stuff added to the store, but you can check them out yourself. Um, remember to follow me on Twitter at RedheadGamer16 if you enjoy the video. Like and subscribe, and I shall see you next time. Okay, thanks guys. Bye. Bye.